You know, the, uh, the, the gift of living in the Pacific Northwest is that we live in one of the most beautiful places, any place. I think it also comes with it the fact that we have to appreciate the fact that climate drives choices. Um, in Minnesota, the level of insulation and the details there are window condensation, all kinds of problems based on climate. In the Southwest, um, the heat, the sun, um, and also water, uh, even though it seems light, happens to be a problem there as well. So imagine Phoenix with eight inches of rain, the problems they have with water. We're up here in 20, 30, 40, even 50, 60 inches of rain based on location in the Northwest. So one of the things that has to happen here is that in the Northwest, we have lower energy prices, which is really a nice thing um, to have. We still have elevating costs to, to produce energy and transport it. So the Pacific Northwest, we really have to manage things like water and rain, flashing properly, picking the right materials, um, making sure that our paint films and our sidings are kept off the building to allow it to dry effectively. All of us have seen in the Northwest here moss growing on the roofs and moss growing on the walls. And most of that is because if, if an area is going to stay wet for a long time, we really need to make sure it's more forgiving, that we are managing things like paint and sealants um, around openings, redoing things more often that uh, didn't need as much service in other marketplaces. So the climate challenge that creates this beautiful living environment also creates a challenge to the environment of buildings, and they need a little more attention, a little more care. So I would say every time we look at the marketplace, old technologies need to uh, improve because we know we're adding efficiency to this market. That means durability has got to enhance almost equally at the same rate. And I'm watching too many people leave old techniques for managing water as they improve the building enclosure, and that's a bad formula. We've got to improve flashing and, and, and water management techniques at nearly the same pace or faster than we improve the thermal performance of buildings. So our buildings dry slower because less energy is flying through the building. It's important that we are careful to manage the water more than anything else. So interior environments and exterior environments challenges building durability. So if you build here, you get to live here, do the right thing, and really take care of that business.